Hi, um, so I briefly wanted to talk to you about Sarah Ahmed's uh, Living the Feminist Life book, um, which I found thought-provoking and visionary um, in really generating um, um, and trying to bring feminist theory home. She uh, does this by um, uh, focusing on out-of-ordinary experiences of uh, being a feminist. Um, her book really illustrates how the personal is political. Um, it resonates with me at a very personal level given that I call myself an African feminist. And, you know, it raises some 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 questions around what does it mean to live your life uh, by claiming the word feminism. That is basically being a feminist, becoming a feminist, and speaking as a feminist. And um, she also raises the question around when did feminism become a word that not only spoke to you, but spoke you, spoke of your existence, spoke into your existence. Um, she also explores this idea of uh, thinking around uh, the question of from whom did we find feminism. Uh, um, she writes, um, why we find feminism matters, from whom we find feminism uh, matters. I also part, uh, particularly find it interesting how she uses the word you when she talks about her uh, life experiences of gender-based violence. Um, she explains that she did this intentionally to illustrate how uh, violence alienates you from yourself. Um, as a scholar, I found it particularly interesting uh, um, her discussion on citation and labeling, which she um, calls feminist memory, uh, because I think as feminists, it is important that um, we critically analyze how we generate data and how we generate knowledge uh, in this instance that is specifically around issues around how we write in and in whom we cite uh, because Ahmed uh, um, explains that she in 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 our, in our citing certain authors it is also acknowledging the people uh, that came before us um, you can read the full blog post um, on, on the book but I wonder how is the word feminism position in your life that is how do you engage with it and how does it engage with you? Thank you.